notice the futures. While this is not a rock solid indicator, it does tend to point to the direction the market will open overall. But it could change in a heartbeat. So the values may be limited. Morning. It's 6 a.m. Wednesday, October the 5th. Yesterday, we saw the market really have a big gain. Um, the futures today point to a much lower opening. Yeah, 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 yeah. But anyway, uh, the stock that I'm basing my options contracts on is uh, HBI, Haynes Brands International. So that went up to, I think the high on that was about 770 something. Uh, it closed around 750. And so today I expect it to go down. I hope it'll go down. But Anyway, like I mentioned yesterday, here's the the point I'm trying to make. Is you've got a tremendous amount of day trading going on. And uh, a lot of short sellers. So the way the day trade works is the price goes up. They sell a bunch of stock short, which drives the price down. And then when it turns around and starts to go back up, then it's everybody heads for the exit and, and tries to cover their shorts. And that can drive up the price of the stock quickly. So for me, it makes no difference at all, except on Fridays. Well, let me take that back. It can make a difference if somebody exercises the options I sold early. Uh, but that rarely happens. Most people are buying options in order to trade them. They really don't want the stock. They may not even have the money for, to buy the stock or just or stock to sell. So um, the chances of an early execution are pretty rare. Um, it does happen. And in a volatile market like this, it's more, it tends to happen more frequently than it would otherwise. Um but at any rate, uh, today's going to be interesting. Remember, this is Wednesday, not even the, the open. There's three more trading days in this week. The price of HBI could be anywhere by, by the close of uh, market Friday. Um, but this is the kind of thing that sort of makes it, you know, it's like being on the sidelines in a football game, you know, and the score's going back and forth, back and forth. Uh, it's about as exciting as it gets, I guess. Um, but, uh, the other point I need to make about this is that when the market goes sideways for a long time, that is the price stays very stable for a long time, the premiums that I can get for those contracts goes down tremendously because people don't see the risk. So, and it's the volatility that makes the, uh, option contract buyers feel like they can make some money by uh, paying me a premium for those contracts. So today will be interesting. Uh, if there's much notable activity, I'll jump in after the market opens and do another video. But otherwise, um, it's just going to be the same until Friday. <laughs> Have a good day. And, uh, Please subscribe, notify, and like. Thank you very much.